Tonight's Little League game just wrapped up here at Widener Field in West Carrollton. It's the start of a season that's sure to be a memorable one and not just for the kids. A couple quick questions. Your team properly equipped? Yes, sir. Very good. Your team properly equipped? Yes, sir. It's hard to tell who's more excited to be out on the field. The hundreds of kids in the Moraine West Carrollton Little League or Jeff Stoko, the umpire behind the plate? He's been making the tough calls for 17 years as a volunteer umpire with the league. I enjoy the game, but I, I actually enjoy teaching kids more. A reward in itself, but this year there's a little extra incentive. Stoko has been selected by his peers to be one of just a few umpires for the premier 12-year-old Little League World Series in Williamsport, Pennsylvania. It's a big honor. It's a big honor. It's called the Granddaddy of Mall. It's actually the one that everybody wants to do. I mean, there's all ages from, you know, from five year old all the way up to 18, but the premier 12 year old is the one that everybody talks about. Tim Snyder is president of the Moraine West Carrollton Little League and one of Stoko's biggest supporters. It's really for the kids, you know, and it's hard to find those certain people to do that, and he is one of them special people. Stoko says he's humbled to have been selected. <laughs> And after dedicating almost two decades to the diamond, he can handle the pressure. And I'm going to give you a little, a little sign every time I work the plate at the World Series. And is ready to make Moraine West Carrollton Little League proud. Before I put the ball in play, I'm holding my hand up. That's for my mother. That's for my mother-in-law. That's for my brother. This is for all of you. Thank you. And this year's Little League World Series game is going to be played August 21st through the 30th. Now, Stoko says he won't know till he's there if he's actually going to get to ump the World Series game, but says even standing on the right field line would be a dream come true. Reporting live in West Carrollton, Megan O'Rourke, 2 News on your side.